After making that big splash and into the Megasite's consciousness, I think that's how you say it, I don't know what's really going on. But to sum it up, Rose wants to get rid of her powers and thanks to her friend Kay, I think it's her friend or mentor, let's leave it at that, she needs to dive in and grab some sort of crystal which will allow her to be a normal girl and make friends. Basically, she wants to be friends with Regina George. With that thought in mind, let's go ahead and help Rose achieve her mission slash goal. And there was a couple of notes around, but not really important. We went ahead and opened the door, which leads us into what I assume is the Dimitrescu estate in Kansas anymore. I know I love using that every time. I'll be next if I'm not quick. I need to get that crystal. Huh? Huh? What does that even mean? Yep, we found the shoe, everybody. We found the shoe. Oh, wow. After finding a very significant so item, I want to find someone banging on the door. Let me out. Finally, a person in this horrid, wretched place. Is someone there? Dangerous here. What um. is? Why? Hang tight. I'm gonna see if I can find a key. We're gonna go ahead and help a girl that we barely know. We don't even know if it if she's friend or foe. We're just gonna help her. Look around the area. Only to find Rose's it's, name. Your name is on there, Rose. And it wants you dead. That's my name. Nah, nah, yeah, nah. They just, just wrote it there for fun. And look here, you guys. A key, which will help open the door of our mysterious friend or foe. I don't think you should be stepping on that. Okay. How can you be this dense, Rose? You're stepping on this weird, funky stuff that looks like goop juice. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Here it is. I went back to open the door, but you get distracted by a picture on the ground as if it was a Vincent van Gogh painting. Only for the goop to get a bit handsy. Someone's getting weirdly grabby. No. No. Okay, nope, nope. But someone saved us. That someone is Rose. Meaning, in technicality, she saved herself. Let's keep moving. But... The clone Please walks stop. off and leaves us behind, as if nothing happened. I tried to follow her, since she's the only semblance of something living and breathing here. She looks at us with her dead eyes, needing to deadlift that body. Obviously, she missed arm day. By the way, she's dragging that body. Yeah, they, you guys need some li weightlifting training here. Whoever made these clones made them like weaklings. With the clone freaking out, not sure what to do since the switch is not working. But looking at the contraption closer, we needed a switch handle. Uh, switch handles missing. Walked around to find the handle, only to hear someone getting choked. Wait. Oh, someone's getting choked. More roses! Oh, so many doppelganger roses. While getting at the end of the tunnel, only to find another one of our clones with her face messed up. Don't think makeup can cover that. Just, get, just kick her face in. And look, I found the handle. Going back to the main room, screaming could be heard, only to find the non-deadlifting clone who could not lift is getting her face sucked. Not surprising. What's that? Oh, no! oh god, ah, oh, her her face got eaten out. Not in that kind of way. Not the type of eating out that you wanna you don't wanna get. <laughs> out of nowhere, Rose uses her powers by accident. Though since neither Rose or I know how to use her powers, we proceed to use the switch handle. Okay, 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 while we okay. run around in circles, waiting for this goddamn door to open. Not exactly. Okay, no, I gotta go. Okay, okay, no, no. If this is a representation of that time of month, uh, I guess it's weirdly accurate. As I ran all the way towards the end, only to find that this is where our journey stops. It's nice knowing you, Rose. No! Stay back! Yet the wall behind us miraculously open. And again, we have to not question it. RMC ran and crawled, ending up in one of the Dimitrescu rooms, only for the yellow ride to talk to us. What? 
Not enemy. Okay. What were those things? Mm. What is happening here? Go while you can. Not until I get this out of my body. There's a crystal here that will remove the mold. I, I need to find it. And I'm not leaving until I do. Too dangerous. Who are you? M my guardian angel? Sure. The, uh, do you have a name? Maybe it's his, her dad. An angel, then... Angel Gabriel? Michael? Michael? Michael. Because you gave the name, Rose. Michael? What now? After having that lovely talk with the yellow writing, I walked around trying to figure out where to go. Though a familiar voice can be heard. Because they're. Another. Only to find none other than the Duke. How could he betray us? He was our buddy in the main game. Uh, no, let me go. It would seem this little rabbit lacks the necessary fortitude. <laughs> a pity. If you had shown a little grit and actually escaped, that purifying crystal would now be yours. The crystal. And our MC ends up revealing herself. Who's this? <laughs> oh, now we have a new little rabbit to pursue. My question is, is this really the Duke? Hunt her down. He ran from the Duke's monsters, okay, no. ending up in a dead end. What now? But Michael decides to help us by Need? having us touch his words. Touch my words. <laughs> touch what, it. Like Oh god, she got them veins. Again, not questioning it. And there it is. We have ourselves a gun. And it's time to shoot stuff despite the fact that Rose probably never held a gun in her entire life. I'm making sure that I got... Okay. Walk towards the kitchen to find another one okay. of these mold monsters greeting us. And found some bolt cutters. Which is important to opening the door, which leads to the courtyard. Yeah. Ow. Mask trapped. Nush. Break the core. Core. How do you break do it you then? Mean that gross, lumpy thing. How am I supposed to break it? Use your powers. My powers. I literally came here to get rid of them. Only way. Fine, but how? What am I supposed to do? Need an amplifier. What's that? Keep going through the door. After finding out that we need to amplify our powers, I think that's what it means, I guess, by amplifier. Decide to enter through this door, which leads us into a library. And of course, more mold monsters to greet us. Yet one of them grabbed Rose. Only to end our journey that way. I mean, imagine if it ended like that, and then Rose wouldn't even need to get rid of those powers now. Then again, the end screen says she is lost. What does that even mean? We restart again, trying to avoid the mold monsters getting eaten out uh -oh, by some of them, only to find ourselves in the painting room with the mold puddle covering the whole floor. Pushing the ladder down and getting ourselves in some roofing to find a shiny capsule case which gives us the power which i think is the amplifier what am i supposed to do with this thing focus all right hmm i feel different somehow oh. use on the core try now while Michael tells us to use our powers on the core.
which gives us some handgun ammo in return. Proceeding to go back to the Sea of Mold while we take out the core, which causes it to disappear. Yeah. Getting past the library, went back downstairs to find something hulking outside. What's that? Usually indicates that something scary is about to happen. And back to the courtyard to get the first mask. Grabbed it and slipped it on the statue. Okay, so we got one of the masks. And we have three more left to find. Great. I had to go upstairs and took out the core, which leads us into a painting puzzle room. Can't really do much since we are missing a painting here. So I went ahead and searched the other rooms. Okay, let's go. My word, you're just full of surprises. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I end up in the fancy parts of the Dimitrescu rooms with Michael trapping us, reminding us that we are weak, oh, that God. we did not do leg day at all. Oh, fuck you, Michael. He leads us into another room while we make Rose much stronger with the capsule frozen thing here. And apparently, Rose is so strong that it messes with my frame rate. She's that strong. I go back. Using more of her power, which affects my okay, frame rate again, only to end up in the Dimitrescu bathroom, meaning another puzzle. Although I have just drowned, arrows bite dot sting. They hanged me long ago, yet I feel everything. Wait, but still the worst, not last, not first. The sharpened blade did ring. Here. Is this the drowning one? Okay. After solving that puzzle, I descend down the stairs, only to find the big moldy monster with its club. I assume we can't fight this one, so sneak time. After getting past the big oh. Moldo monster and grabbing the mask, to have another oh, oh, hole of mold monsters going Excuse after me. my MC with the fat man talking in the background. I don't speak Spanish. Go away. Go away. God. God. Oh God. These mold people. Ah. Okay. I hated that. Sighing relief, I went back to the Dimitrescu room with Michael talking Mask. to us again. I what about got it, but just barely. This ugly brute turned up. Don't fight, run. No yeah. shit. I can't fight something like that. <laughs> take this. I'll take all the help I can get. After talking to Michael, who I think is Ethan, went through the bathroom to find the missing Wait. painting. Well, still has her bathtub here. I place the painting in oh, the empty frame, painting. which <gasps> gives us a key. And if you remember, there's a shotgun in the dining room. It's cool. I mean, it's always nice to see Lady Dimitrescu's uh, castle over again. This should make things easier. Well, if you're a rookie, I don't, th I don't think it would make a difference. I went outside again, finding an area which I've never been in. Took out the core and had to figure out. To get the final mask, you have to like get up. Okay, fuck that. Okay. <laughs> We're getting it. We're pulling it. As soon as we grab the last mask, only to be captured and forced to play the Duke's game. Oh wait, are we... Rise and shine, little one. What a shame. You have 
was a hop, a skip, and a jump away from claiming your crystalline prize. I knew the real rose would be so much more lively. It would be a shame to snuff you out so unceremoniously. Shall we prolong our fun a little longer? Well, this is oh, not fun. Now, don't pout. I've prepared a nice little diversion for you. Oh, no. So many Squarosia. Nearly all of them are counterfeit. Do you think you can suss out the real ones? <laughs> Time is running out, little one. Tick tock, tick tock. You'll be swallowed right up if you don't hurry. I don't know. Supposed to tell the difference. But I did not realize that Michael is helping us. But instead, instead of doing that, I destroy I try to destroy every core that I see in front of me, only for some of them to appear. And since I did not listen to Michael, only to lead my MC to die in the progress. While getting swallowed by the mold. Okay, you, you can stop screaming now, Rose. I was like, girl, you can stop screaming now, you already did it. I eventually figured it out and got to the crystal, placing the last mask on the okay. statue. That should give us the crystal light at least. But I feel like this is all a trap. Okay, we got we got this ugly ass crystal. <laughs> well done, little one. You've more than earned this reward. Yet like anything in any game, Almost it's just like a decoy. <laughs> <laughs> Did you really think I'd give away something so precious? I had to bait the trap with something. <laughs> no! 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 <laughs> okay, that's interesting. <coughs> the perfect place for your demise. <laughs> Let the show begin! And forced to fight the big Moldo monster. You, the battle music. Saving, I was saving up my shotgun bullets for this big guy. Okay, 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 bro. Okay, running. Where's he gonna? Hey, mother! Come on! I know he's gonna come out of nowhere. No! No! Oh! Enough with the dilly now. Finish this! You... Oh, finally! Finally killed big... Useless creature! Such a disappointment! <sighs> No matter, your imminent demise is inevitable. Okay, what now? Well, where we run? We go run! Rue. Here. Go, go run, Rose, run! Just go- yeah, just jump! After Rose jumps into the abyss only to find herself in the village, but in the Vienniviento's part, Michael and Ethan are talking to us again. A deep stratum. Stratum. Yes. Deeper you are, the harder to escape. Oh, shit. Leave. Need to leave while you can. I don't want to leave. Not until I find that crystal. I'm tired and she really free. wants to join Regina George's crew. Friends. I'm just saying, not worth normal. it. If that purifying crystal can make that happen, make me normal, then I'm not going back until I find it. Stubborn. <laughs> yeah, so? It's her dad. I think it's her dad, so let's get 
searching. All right, then. Let's stroll past the baby carriage with a monkey doll in it. And more monkey dolls. I think this is from the beginning of Ari Village. I think this was her doll, from what I remember. I went inside and found an elevator, which is giving me PTSD vibes. I don't want to do this. I mean, I hope there's no babies here. No. It's an umbilical cord. Oh god. No. I hate it. Fucking hate it. <laughs> Michael, who I think is Ethan, What's is probably on? getting some PTSD vibes as well. Look, no one, no one can forget okay. about that damn baby, okay? That's all I have to say. The elevator door opens for us, showing us more monkey dolls. I really do not like monkey dolls now. Now I'm seeing it everywhere. And we found another important journal. Oh, today was my first day of school. I always want to go. I'm gonna bug Chris. I'm gonna give Chris a big hug next time I see him. There were so many kids my age. It was like I walked into a TV show or something. I was so scared when I had to introduce myself to the class. But I was still super duper excited to be there. I'm gonna make so many friends and I'm gonna try to talk to them tomorrow. Oh no. Long story short, this is the reason why Rose wants to join the plastics. So she can just be a normal girl and have friends and not have these weird powers yeah someone finally talked to me lucy from class said she'd always want to be friends we're going to have lunch together tomorrow i can't believe it i'm so happy i hope lucy's friend katzen will be my friend too it makes me sad now because now i'm like thinking ah oh, man bullying not really not really uh, i mean kids can be asked but sometimes the ones that are assholes usually have problems at their own home so they pick on someone that's different. After reading her heart-wrenching thoughts and realizing it is actually Rosa's thoughts, we continue on towards the main hall, only to find a painting of her. Uh, is there a picture of me? That to accentuate your features, obviously. While commenting on her average features, continue towards the main room, and we found the crystal. Since it is captured in a cage, we clearly cannot grab it, which is of course ridiculous in my opinion. Oh, I was hoping one of them to be in the trash, because I think all of them should be in the trash. The crystal's right there, but there's no way to get it. F uh, Area changes again, which shows the monkey doll in the, stitches. Tear it open. His stomach has been stitched up. It looks like there's something inside. I walked along the hallways with these beautiful the drawings scrawled along the walls. Uh, finding a picture with a helpful hint. The stuff locker, the picture on the bookshelf, and the desk covered in stuff. 44. No, you should probably put that in the the sink. 66. Blue 2. After putting the numbers Good. in the locker, it opens showing us some scissors, which is okay. what we're gonna use to cut up the monkey doll. Well, there's hands. That's great. I'm more flattered. I, I, and... <gasps> what the hell? Well, that's why we're gonna... we're gonna... crawl. Oh, whoa, whoa! I just saw something walk. Okay, so... I cut up the monkey, which shows us a relic for the door that okay. we passed right after we read Rose's thoughts. Shut the fuck up, little girl. <laughs> oh... I think I know who this is. Oh, oh, fuck. <gasps> Maybe, maybe run. Maybe, maybe run. Uh, you know how to play with dolls, don't you? Again? What now? I went around and looked for the doll statues. First one we got is Lucy. I run around some more and use the relic from the monkey to open this door up, which reveals another doll, Catherine. Get the feeling the names of these dolls pertain to real life people in her, in Rose's life. Basically, Lucy is Regina George, from what I gather. Finally, getting to the bathroom puzzle, which triggers the dolls, opening the drawer. I went towards Jimmy's room and destroyed the core while going down the well, finding yet another ass? doll, which I assume is probably Jimmy. And look, the mannequin is back no. again. Stop! Why you gotta keep following me? 
completed another puzzle with another statue shown to us, which will complete the last puzzle. And again, Mannequin Lady is back. She really is a stalker. I should probably put a restraining order on this doll. While completing the last oh, one, I answered fine. the phone to see who's on the other end. Jeez, bro, you're still looking for the crystal? <laughs> fine, I'll help you out. Just take the elevator to me. God, I no. Mean, might be upset that I'm helping you, though. God. Who are you? And now, we need to get back to the elevator. It's the part where I saw the baby. And I ran. Let's play statues. It's game over if they catch you. Well, but first, we need to grab the fuse. I grab the map. And the trick here is to not let those mannequin dolls grab us. And we can only stop it from following us if we stare no! into its eyes. As you can see, that is my worst nightmare. Didn't know that you get this shy. Jesus Christ! Running! Running! Run! Oh my gosh, there's two of them. Ah! No! No! Well, that's great. Why aren't you doing this? You're after the crystal, aren't you? No shit. You know where it is. <laughs> I've gathered some friends just for you. No I shit. And maybe I'll tell. Entertain. Entertain. The elevator door opens, only to find out that the dolls are scaled three times the size. Or more like 16 size. times the size. Not the type of mommy I want to be punished by. Okay, okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Me too, bud. Oh, f***. Oh, f*** you. Oh, f***. Oh, f***. Oh. Oh. After getting to the oh, area God. where we're supposed to meet, only to find more yep, dolls making feel. fun of RMC. Come on, run, Rose. Be the big, big mama, big mama doll is going after you. Come on. Uh, maybe you should run. Ah! Shut the fuck up. Oh god. After that nightmare fuel full of dolls, Dang. only for Michael to talk to us again. Why are they talking about my dad? 
I never even met him. Do you resent him? No. I don't know. I don't know the first thing about him. Hmm. Wish I did. Oh. All I know is he died protecting me. Sometimes I try to imagine what my life would have been like if he hadn't died. Mm. Would he have taught me to ride a bike? Helped me with my homework? Read me a story every night? Oh. Would he have been there for me? Proud of me? Sometimes when I feel lost or afraid, I try to imagine what he might have said to me. Oh, come. I have something you should see. Michael leads us to the house that we briefly stayed in, showing us Rose's um, birthday party and from Ethan's we? perspective. I mean, we already all know that Michael is Ethan at this point. You're safe here. It feels familiar. Like I've been here before. Look at all the decorations. Some kind of party? Decorate the living room done. Yet wine put in the dining room. Rose's other present in the study hidden. She's Aww. so little. <laughs> Hard to believe one day she'll be old enough to share a bottle of wine with her old man. Aww. What's that voice? Is that. Dad? She bangs her spoon every time I play this. I wonder <laughs> if she'll be a musician. Aww. I wonder if dad played any instruments. Not really. I don't think so. Miss D and the pal boys, of course. She just cannot get enough of this stuff. <laughs> I bet dad would feed me as soon as I started crying. I'm so lucky to have you both in my life. Dad. Oh no, that's gonna make me cry now. Don't do this, please. Look upstairs. upstairs? I'll take a look. This tune has always been special for our family. I think I've heard this before. It's pretty. And don't forget Rose's half birthday is on the it's on the second. I'm going to I'm going to make an amazing cake, so you better eat it. In fact, I'm going to make a cake for every special occasion we have. I want you to take lots of pictures of our family album. I haven't seen mom in ages. What happened to mom then? Wait, where where's Mia then? I I know, she's probably a little too young for this, but it was too cute. I oh. wonder how we played with this. This is my bedroom. She's already growing out of these onesies. <laughs> I can't believe I was ever this tiny. Who is Rose's half birthday? Half a year in the blink of an eye. I want to capture this moment with these feelings, so I wrote special something special. I may have gotten a bit sappy though. I'd feel embarrassed if anyone stumbles across it, so it's safe in the sideboard for now. The key is behind my favorite photo. I wonder if she'll look like me when she grows up. Oh, I looked so happy. A letter for me? Happy half birthday, Rose. My gift to you is a promise. I'll always be there for you. What is a happy, no happy what, half birthday? I'll be there every birthday. What does that even mean? Blow out the candles on your cake. I'll that means that he's half a year old. And walk you to school every day. I'll be I mean, there that's what it should literally mean. Dream and sing to you until you fall back asleep. Dang. I'll hug you tight when you're troubled or worried, and tell you that everything's gonna be all right. You. My After reading that heartfelt no. message from her father, only for it to be ruined by Evelyn. No one loves you. <laughs> well, that's no. unfortunate. God Michael, damn you, Evelyn. Michael, help. Michael. <laughs> well, we meet okay, the mastermind look. behind You're not all of girl. this, You're like who a supposedly fucking... know where the crystal no. is at. Isn't here. <laughs> so, you don't have the purifying crystal? No, no, no. This, this is Evil. Of course not. 
No, don't believe her. She's the whole reason for all of this. You have to go deeper. Much deeper. Poor Rose. <gasps> she can't trust anyone. <laughs> Why are you doing this? She's an ass. No one loves you. And when you're dead, no one will care! Enough uh, games. Now you're drowned. I ran in yep. panic as I get Only to a dead end with you. a core right in front of me. Yet I tried to get into the door only oh, to get fuck. sucked in by the mold. Though this happens like three times, I didn't realize that I had to run the other way. Okay, we so we have to go back. Yep, definitely. Just so greedy. Oh. Where do you think you are? I'm going oh, where I want to go. Your families. No, I'm oh, not. Shit. Oh, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Talking of no! Stop it! How are you even here? Okay. Michael. Be careful. No fucking shit, Michael. We're not safe yet. No shit. Evelyn's causing this. That little girl? We still can't get out. Use your powers on her. I can't. She's weak. Okay. Panic, you've got this. And now we need got to this. fight Evelyn. I'll never see. Never! Okay. Watch for her wind blast. Okay. I am obsessed with stupid old Okay. While well, Evelyn is having her Anakin moment. Evelyn's still in her emo face. Only to be saved by none other than Ethan himself slash Michael. Don't give up, Rose. Find that crystal. After Isn't our altercation and falling down another hole, we we'll to find out that Ethan was actually oh, Michael all along. He saved me. But he didn't make it. Don't worry, Dad's still alive. That still alive. Voice. My dad's voice. Is Michael... My dad? Don't give up, Rose. Find that crystal. I mean, again, like I said, we already knew that it was Ethan. Anyways, it's already self-evident. Traveled through the village, only to find more mold people and, and demolish the core leading us to another hole slash cave. And we get to see where all our clone roses came from. Is this where those copies of me came from? I read the notes upon arrival, only get the stinging feeling I know who this is. This? Mother Miranda. Obviously. Okay, to sum up all the notes here, 
is that even in death, she is still obsessed with bringing Ava back to life. And that's the whole point of the clones. And that's why she wanted to... She wanted to bring the real Rose Winters here to bring back Ava still. Again, villains don't really operate on logic very well, to be honest. That god which lives in us and which we live. Create for a new world and befits your will. Your dark consciousness holds for us all, for us a second chance. Graciously offered and joyously accepted. You drink the blood of the lost lamb as it falls upon your darkened earth. Not to destroy, but to preserve. And once again, deliver unto life. After reading that gruesome... Epitaph? I don't even know what it is. It's something for religious purposes. I think that's what it is. Moved on to find none other than the crystal. Okay, Mother Miranda, I know you're here. She's not dead. Uh, I don't- I think you should start running. <laughs> of course, Mother Miranda has to appear, that bitch. Girl. Okay, girl. Rose, She's like, what the fuck's going I've on? So long for you. Seriously, bitch? 16 years? <laughs> My name is Miranda. No, just run. Rose, just run. You would become so Far too powerful for me to subdue directly. So, I had to lure you into this realm so that you might willingly relinquish your powers. No, uh. but Kay said... Did he? Or did I? So basically, Miranda, Miranda just made her talk to herself in the middle of a park an and let herself walk into Very the laboratory. Just her, just by herself. Can become the vessel for my Eva. Okay. <laughs> what the hell is this door? <laughs> I was like, she's been waiting for 18 years. Rose, run! And here he is. It is Ethan. We run you from Mother stay. Miranda with Ethan slash Dad helping us. And he tries to push Rose to run. Go live a normal life. Make friends. No one will ever call you a freak again. But. Rose, just go! I don't want to leave you! I know. I love you, but I need to know you're safe. So please, just... Ethan, you insolent pest! I got this. Get out of here! In which she throws the crystal away, leading her to fight for the Miranda. Stupid copy! I'm me! Rose! And you're done. 
Hey, sweetie. Oh my God! You're, you're so grown up now. Even though I wasn't there with you, I've always watched over you. After that arduous fight with Mother Miranda, so we end with a you. touching scene between father and daughter. Yet it is ruined Never by my done. obvious fucking up the recording. Back. For some reason, <laughs> oh. I'm back. Now it's fine. For some reason, that part of the game, <laughs> that part of the, oh, my remembrance, it just like. Wow, that was... That was deep. Basically, the ending scene is just the same ending from Resident Evil Village. I'm not gonna go ahead and torture you guys over it. My opinion on the DLC, I'd say it's mid at best. I mean, we get a bit more context into Rose right before the ending of Resident Evil Village. But I feel like Dave could have done a bit more. Like, don't get me wrong, the one with the dolls was amazing, <laughs> with the mannequins, even though I hated mannequins. But that was great. The Dimitrescu part was a little bit of a slog. It's kind of slow. And the fight scene, or the fight with Mother Miranda, could have been done a bit better. Like, I wish they could have at least, like, extreme superpowers. She didn't need guns. All she needed was, or I don't know, like, she just becomes, like, a Marvel superhero. Because I felt like that fight was a bit clunky, in my opinion. I feel like that was a bit of a missed opportunity. I would have liked to go, like, Super Saiyan just beating up Mother Miranda. Only to see her die again, which is always funny when it comes to villains. Anyways, if you guys want to try out the game yourself with the DLC, you can check it down in the description box. If you guys do enjoy Shadows of Rose, I do recommend checking out this video right here.